The Regions Bank Postgame Report. Regions Bank, the official bank of the SEC. Mizzou has now won four straight bragging rights matchups with Illinois, and this was a heck of a game, Coach. A little bit of everything in this game. Let's start with the physical nature at times. I mean, Illinois really challenged your guys, and how did you like the way they responded? Well, I thought we responded very well. You know, it was a physical game, and, uh, you know, this was let us play. You know, it was one of those, you know, you really had to, you know, they were going to let us dictate who won the game. And um, uh, I thought our guys handled themselves very well. You know, I thought, you know, early in the game, uh, I thought we executed. Um, and, you know, there were stretches there in the second half where the game got away from us a little bit and they made a run. But games like this, they're going to be runs. And how you handle those runs determine how successful you're going to be. And I thought we handled them very well. Did you feel like Phil Pressey took a step forward in terms of leadership tonight? He was, uh, he was unbelievable. You know, he had uh, a good grasp of his teammates. Uh, and his communication was outstanding. Uh, you know, we really talked about those guys getting together in, a, in this environment. You can't hear me and huddling up so they can communicate better. And uh, I thought he was he was terrific in that regard. How big was this game for you as a coach as, as you continue to, to manage this? And we've talked about it almost after every game about, you know, all the talent you're managing here. And it, it seemed like guys really responded whatever was asked of them in this game. And that's got to be very important for you. It is, you know, and, and as we move forward, as guys being able to understand their role and buy into their role. And I thought, you know, when you're in a game like this, you know, obviously guys want to play, but I think, you know, I thought our camaraderie on the bench, I thought throughout the whole game, guys were into it. And, uh, you know, like Negason having one of his nights, and, and it just happens that way. Same thing with Keon. Then, but they're, they're going to be better days for those guys. But at the same time, look at a guy like Ernest Ross. I mean, you know he's got to want to start, but right. he's in there at the end of the game. And how, how big of a game was this for him in, as, as he continues to grow? Extremely. And, and I think, you know, guys understand when your number's called, you got to be ready to play. You never know. And we got that kind of team where the guys are going to be challenged every day at practice. And, and um, you know, it's, it's a matter of feel when we get into the flow of the game. And he was playing well. And he had really good confidence. He made some big plays. That's nice stick back and one. Uh, uh, oh, I don't forget foul, but uh, I shouldn't say that. But nice stick back in, in traffic. And uh, But he had some good defense possessions. I thought our team defense was really, really good tonight. And, and it needed to be against a really good offensive team like Illinois. You're 2-0 in this game now. Is there anything better than this, winning this game uh, with, with the energy that's in the building on a night, like, night like this? Uh, yeah, on this stage, in, you know, when the lights are the brightest, uh, right before Christmas, this is, a, this is a really, you know, we can enjoy Christmas. Uh, I would have enjoyed it anyway, but we can really enjoy it tonight. Coach, thank you. Thank you. That's head coach Frank Haith after the Tigers' fourth straight win in the Bragg and Wright Series.